This is the first demonstration of the hexapod head that I have built in the in the past weeks. It uh, has two servo motors, Dynamics AX12. So the head has two degrees of freedom, and on the second motor there is the 3D printed mount. Uh, for the USB camera and for a line laser. When you take a closer look you can see that the angle of the camera let's move it a little bit. So now you can see that the angle of the camera and the angle of the line laser uh, it's not the same. There is a movement uh, towards the mid plane of the camera from the laser line. So the closer something is and reflects the laser line, the higher in respect to the camera picture the line um, is visible on the screen. So the Purpose is of course a kind of distance sensor for a, for a plane. I will mount the head now and show you the image processing on it. Okay, so here you see the head uh, mounted and it's switched on so the line laser projects. Um, a line on that table and now the electronic part uh, for computation I use the old droid U3 um, running RAS on it and open CV for the image processing um, and there is the U3 shield on top for the switch on the, the line laser. To drive the Dynamixels I have the USB to AX but it's not so important in that video. On the screen you can now see the picture on the right on the left hand side you can see the real raw data. It's of course red due to the laser line filter and in the center result picture you can see the um, processed image where the laser line is um, calculated from the background. So now what you can see if I if I move something into the laser line you can see that the laser line is projected on that part um, and on the screen since it's not in parallel to the to the center line of the camera you can see that the closer the object is moving the higher the laser line is seen with the with the USB camera so you can use that perfectly as a distance sensor or you can see in the right hand side picture that um, if there is a, an edge where one line is more far away from the camera and, and uh, part of the line is closer then the picture is looking like that and you see uh, the height is representing the distance so when I move my, my hand into it you can see how or the fingers. Um, it's quite a nice resolution. It's about 3mm. I don't use any sub-pixel algorithm at the moment so it can be a, uh, improved. But for a first impression I think um, the idea is clear and it's working 
quite well so far. Thank you.